new here, my name is Ruthie, um, and today I'm going to be showing you guys a little Hobby Lobby haul. So I did go to Hobby Lobby just the other day and to look at all their Christmas stuff. I had to like refrain from getting a lot of things, um, but the things that I did pick up are things that I'm going to be using. But also, if you don't know, I have two little boys. I have a two and a half year old, and then I have a ten month old who is turning one on twelve sixteen, which is my birthday. Uh, we share a birthday and I am currently planning his first birthday party. So a lot of these items that I got are actually for his birthday party. Um, and his birthday party this year is going to be a winter wonderland. wonderland. Um, and so it's going to be kind of like rustic-y, like a lot of white and like rustic and snow. I don't know if that makes any sense. But it's kind of like my idea of it all. And then his cake smash is going to be kind of the same thing. A little woodsy, um, white, rustic kind of vibe. I don't know. You may be able to tell by some of the items that I got, um, kind of the theme that I'm going for. Um, I did spend like $100, but everything was 50% off, so it was actually like a really good deal. So the first two items that I grabbed were these wrapping papers. Um, it's Christmas Party Craft Gift Wrap. It's 100 square feet. Um, it was $8.99, and it was 50% off, so $4.99. So I got two of them. It has like the grid lines on the back, so it's really nice when you're cutting. I got two of them, and I think this is going to be my wrapping paper that I'm using this year underneath the tree. Um, and I think I think this wrapping paper is so pretty, and I'm like obsessed. Like every year, I try to get like a specific wrapping paper that all the presents are in that paper. What's up? Hi. He just woke up from his nap, of course, as soon as I'm trying to film. Um, so the next thing I got is right here. It's this beautiful little gift box um it's in fur with like a burlap um, ribbon on it and then the top has like pine cones and like little snow and it's literally so beautiful it has like a little bit of a glitter on it as well it is so so pretty this was the most expensive thing this was actually 35 dollars but again, it was 15% off. This is actually something that I saw like last minute and I was like, oh my goodness. So this I could just picture on like the desserts table, but then also for his cake smash just sitting in the back. I died when I saw this. And this is exactly the theme that I'm going for. I actually have stockings that I got two years ago now. And it's actually like the fur. So I think it looks so, so, so pretty for just like a decoration around Christmas time too. It's just like playing right here, but this was absolutely gorgeous and I, I just had to get it. So the next thing I got was actually this like craft snowflake. Um, it was $12.99, so I ended up being $6.99. Um, and it looks like this. It's just like a wooden snowflake. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to paint this all white. And then I think this is going to be like my main piece behind his uh, dessert table that says um, Asher's Wonderland. Or I may mean, just write Wonderland. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to write exactly, but something along those lines. And it's huge, so I definitely think that would be really, really pretty. Um, I do have a Cricut, so I plan on just using my Cricut for like a vinyl piece on there. Um, and then afterwards, I can always use that just like as a decoration for like the wall around my house or something. Around Christmas time, I just changed the decal out. So, grab my bag. The next thing I found was this. This was not on sale, but it's a paper mache number one. Um, so it looks like this. So again, I just plan on painting this all white. And then I don't know, but I may wrap the bottom part, like this part right here, in like a burlap or um, like a, a twine or something along, along that line, I think. I'm not quite sure, but it's going to be definitely white and maybe like a little bit of a brown tone. Um, I don't know quite yet, but that's my plan for this. And I think it's just so stinking cute. Um, and again, I'm actually using this for his dessert table, but then also for his cake smash to have in the background. Next thing I found, my toddler actually really got into it, but it was this. It's called, it says candy cane. I didn't realize that they were for candy canes. That's so cute. I thought it was just, oh, I thought it was just a craft. But this is a candy cane kit, it says. So apparently, it's a reindeer. But you're supposed to put candy canes on them. So this is what it looks like. Apparently you're supposed to put candy canes on the sides of it. But we've been kind of just doing it as a little bit of a craft. So this is the one that Landon made already. Um, he does have his antlers on. But it's actually cute because I was putting where the back is all 
Um, it's also a sticker. So you probably just put candy cane in between and then it's so cute. Yeah, so we already dug into those. And this was $5.99 and then again it was 50% off. So next thing I found was this. It says My Little Christmas. It's just these snowflakes. It was $2.99, 50% off. So it looks like this. And I think with this, what I plan on doing for his cake smash is just putting it on like a clear um, string and hanging a few of them up and down like in the background just to have a little bit of the dimension. But then also I think I'm going to lay these flat on the dessert table um, just to have a little bit of a pop of snowflakes. So I got those. And this has how many pieces are in here? Eight pieces. So got those. The next thing I found was an icicle garland. It was $4.99, so it ended up being $2.99. It just looks like this. I'm thinking about putting this along the bottom part of the dessert table. I'm not quite sure yet, but I thought this was really, really cute. And again, this is reusable, so I can actually just put this um, as like a, a craft or something in the future. I don't know, but it's an ice garland. I may put this in the dessert table, but I also may put it... I'm going to do like a hot chocolate bar, so I may put it over there. I don't know. We'll see. Um, next thing I found was just some paint. This was just $5.99. It's just iridescent white. So it has kind of like a little bit of like a shine to it. Or like a, a glitter, I should say. Like a, kind of like a silvery to it. So I got that. Next thing I found, not even party related. And China, if you're watching this, don't look anymore. I got this for my friend's son. I saw it and I just had to buy it. It was $7.99 for it. And her son's like nursery theme is Star Wars. So I saw the baby Yoda. I saw the baby Yoda ornament, so I just had to get it for him. I thought it was so 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 cute. <laughs> um, so I plan on just writing on the back of it, like from like Love the Terras and then the year. That way just so River has a good memory of us since we are moving and you know military life. Who knows if we'll ever be reconnected? But I thought it'd be so cute. So I got that. Um, next thing I got. Was, oh my god, I couldn't when I found these. I thought they were so 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 cute. Um, I found two of these Christmas bags. They were $8.99, so they ended up being $4.99 each. Um, and they look like this. They're so cute. They're actually bags, like little bags from Santa. Um, I thought since my boys are pretty little still, getting a small sack would have been better. And then there's actually ones, I think it's from Pottery Barn. I think it's Pottery Barn. And they have like the huge ones that you can have like their names on it. And I love those, but I just don't want to get them that many gifts yet. So... I don't want to get them that many gifts yet from Santa, so I thought the smaller sacks were cuter for now at least. Um, once they get bigger, I'll probably get a bigger one, but this one is white, and this one is red, so one for each of my boys. Um, the red one says, first class, do not open before December 25th, no peeking, important gifts and clothes. Express delivery from the North Pole, and this one says, express mail service, North Pole delivery to be delivered on December 25th, certified. So I got these, and I thought they'd be so cute, so... I plan on putting Santa's gifts in there. I also found this Christmas shop garland. Um, it's it was seven ninety nine. It was originally fourteen ninety nine. I think seven ninety nine, and it looks like this. Oh, you guys, this is so beautiful. Um, I want to put this around my tree, but I plan on using it. I think for part of the party decoration. Um, or just for my treat, but I love this so much, so I had to grab this. I could honestly probably make it. I actually just bought a bunch of beads to start doing some keychains, and I've sold a few. Um, but I bought, I could have made this, but I saw it, and I was like, oh, it's perfect. And tassels are pretty hard for me right now to figure out how to do it, so I thought this was really cool, so I got this. And then the last thing I got were these gift tags. They were wooden gift tags, $4.99, so they ended up being $2.99. There's 12 count. And they're like wooden. They're like a white wood with like a twine. And I plan on for their, um, I'm going to do little like goodie bags or something. Um, but depending on how it, how many people come because of COVID and stuff, I don't really, we're not going to do a huge party. But we're still going to do something pretty small for Asher because it's his first birthday. Um, so I'm either going to write something on here or I may personalize it per the family. But yeah, I think they're so stinking cute. And then obviously I may have extra just to put onto gifts or whatever. But I thought they were so, so, so cute. Um, so it looks like that. And that is what I got at Hobby Lobby. Um, I think I got like, oh wait, I ended up getting like two more things. They were like little craft things I ended up getting. 
um, a stretchy, a stretchy material. I forget what it's called, but it's like to make like a bracelet type thing that I don't know how to explain it. But I got that. So that's um, all I got at Hobby Lobby. Hope you guys enjoyed this little haul. If you guys are excited for Asher's first birthday, I plan on filming it, I think, or kind of showing decorations or kind of prepping for it. So stay tuned for that. It will be in two months, but it's coming up. Asher's Cake Smash is going to be next month. I'm doing it early um, just because there's a lot going on with the holidays and moving and stuff. So planning on doing it just next month. Um, and I plan on doing like the cake by myself and everything. So I'm going to definitely film all that. So stay tuned. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this little Hobby Lobby haul. Um, if you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one.